Yeah. Uh, you know, I just realized, uh, this song, every time when I was a kid, I thought that she was saying later we'll have some fucking crack. And then when I got older, I realized she said pumpkin pie. Some fucking crack. The halls of fouls of folly rocking around the Christmas tree and it. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. It was either fucking crack or fucking pie or something. I, I don't remember. Listen, you can't, you can't judge me for mishearing something. Okay. I was a kid and we had shitty speakers and it was all muffled. Now that I have headphones on, it's easier to hear. But as a kid, I was like, why is she saying fucking in a Christmas song? It, it don't make sense. I don't know. Good morning, everybody. What's up? That gives a whole new meaning to white Christmas. Hey, listen. A white Christmas is an exciting Christmas. Gets your heart racing, you know? Sometimes, sometimes you don't realize that a white Christmas might be white for a lot of reasons. Come included. Yeah, Christmas music. That's, that's what I'm saying. Katie, it's exciting. It's the holiday season. We are past the time. We are past the time of Thanksgiving. You know what that means. You know what that means. We're going to starve to death. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, it's going to be a good day. What's up, dudes? How we doing today? Uh, let's go with... There we go. Please tell me there's food in the food locker. Please tell me there's food in the fridge locker. Please tell me there's food. Oh, God. Yeah. God damn, there's no food. I'll take a nap. I feel refreshed. God, I wish. All right. Anyway, what's up, dudes? How we doing today? Hope we're doing great. God. Why do you never have food? Flop always has food. What do you mean? We just always look for food. We need it. It's just flop being flop. Also, I just, I don't care. <laughs> I never did. Jingle bell, jingle bell rock. All right. Got to do offline mode real quick. Uh, anyway, what's up dudes? How we doing today? Hope we're doing well. Hope we're doing amazing. Who's all on duty? We got 15 cops on duty. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at us go. Let's see what's going on well, on the radio. We going on anything anything on the radio anything on channel two i'm oh, sorry i'm fixing my shit okay there we go sorry all right nice uh god i don't even know what i did today i ran out today oh my god the stores were so fucking packed there was a guy filling his entire shopping cart today with uh with uh yams like the canned like yams or whatever because they were sell they were just dumping them guy had like 
30 cans in his fucking shopping cart and at the register the lady was like well what are you doing he goes ah i just love me some yams and i'm thinking what the fuck what are you gonna bathe in a man 30 fucking cans of yams what are you doing dude he's doing something with those yams i don't know what it is yet are you okay i feel like he lost a bet ah fuck shit 220 41 uh 10-2 Copy that. D10 is uh, feeling great. 10 8. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> it's feeling great. I'm glad. 220. I'm also feeling great. Hell yes, we're feeling great. Any food places open right now that we know of? 10 9. Any uh, restaurants open at the moment? No idea, man. God damn it. Flop, I tell you what, you come on down to some mom memorial, I'll get you some pizza. <laughs> 220 in fucking route. <laughs> Holy shit, it's Tim, dude. Tim was the first person I ever met on NoPixel. God damn it. Sarah with the 22 months, two months away from two years, by the way. That's a long ass time. Thank you so much for the 22. I almost said two. 22 months resub thank you thank you bunch of hearts how are you all doing who in their right mind needs that many yams i don't fucking know to be honest with you i i really i i don't i don't know i only i only christmas candles today what i'm assuming that was autocorrect i bought christmas candles today and if you if it was i bought christmas candles what kind of candles Holy shit. What's up, fella? Oh my god. What is going on? Get over here. Uh, I'm, I'm Luna now. Hello. How you doing, buddy? I'm doing great. How are it. you? Hold on. I'm, I'm tired, there. man. What do you mean you're tired? Yeah. Why? It's been a shitty He's few days. Out. What do you mean? Food coma? No. Oh, what happened? But there's Death, pizza ICUs, oh. the, the yeah, worst, bro. Yeah, a lot of that. Oh. Free food. Oh my God, thank yeah, you. There's, there's pizza, yeah. Here's a joy. Take as much as you need, like, no. for other people too. Yeah, no, definitely. I, I, I will thank you. I appreciate it. I'll, I'll just take a couple. I appreciate you. You're amazing. No problem. Well, damn. Well, Tan, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that things haven't been good. I, there's a lot I happening. That. There's a lot happening. Always, dude. God Always. Damn. God damn it. Oh. What's that? I don't know. Are people oh, getting another, shot at? I think a cop fell down or something. I don't know. Oh, you know what? I'm going to drink another pizza. I don't know. Today's been slow. So that was like the first bit of action at 13A that didn't play out. I grabbed an extra slice of pizza by accident. My bad. Let me Go. put that back. She said take whatever you want. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Listen, I don't want to. I don't want to ruin the system and have like have like, you know, one less pizza in the meal and then have someone come by and not get a pizza in their meal. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that's, that's fair. True. That's fair. That's I can't You're listen. You're always Eat. thinking about others. You could spot. take a whole always another meal. No, 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 no. It's OK. It's OK. I appreciate All it, though. Alrighty. No problem. Um, You're welcome. Yeah, yeah. Tim, I have to ask you an honest question. Kinda... Yeah, I will. Where the Thank fuck you. have you been? Where, uh, have, where, where have you been? Where? I usually do like hour long shifts, and it turns out you, you're working like late nowadays. Thank you. Oh, thank you. God. Welcome, I'm, guys. yeah, I just got a duty. Yeah. I know. Any actors right now? But you know what? You, uh, you be around this weekend? Around. Someone's Wait. falling around. Uh, yeah, I will, actually. Yeah. I'm gonna yeah, say this. Sure it keeps the up. Take it how you will, but I'm gonna jump in your vehicle at some point. And if she doesn't, I'm gonna. And if it doesn't her. happen, I don't oh, care. That's right. She went. Mom, we can try to work it out. I'm down. And we'll figure it out. All right, cool. I'm down. Well, maybe, I'll shoot for tomorrow, maybe. Perfect. Sounds good. Appreciate well, you, smooches. Oh, smooches. I love you guys. I'll talk Dude. soon. Bye, Bob. Sorry, I'm a little late to respond. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any actors on main right now. I did hear someone's going on popping channel one when I got on duty, but uh, just the 71s. I'm, I'm probably going to grab gas and respond. All right. I only ordered uh, Christmas candles. What are like good Christmas scents? What the? F they're empty. Oh, hell, dude. I'm going to I'm going to shit my pants. Oh, we have to grab flops. Check, too. I got a uh, classic Christmas tree, huckleberry mistletoe. 
uh snowy walk peppermint champagne and a special edition candy land interesting just fans what's going on how you doing today hope you're doing well oh chat oh chat oops shit i love mistletoe scent what is a mistletoe scent does it, does it just smell like sweat because mistletoes lead to sex isn't that how that works like if you go under the mistletoe right i don't know I'm sorry. It, it, it's it's going to be, it's going to be one of those days. Um, man, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what the plan is. We might do some lethal company in a little bit with some people though. Uh, kind of planning that out right now. Oh, I'm just grab the money. It's a very fresh pine spruce scent. Ooh, I might actually like that. Chris, you menace. I know. I like tobacco candles though. I like, like, like leather tobacco. Like I, I just, I don't know. I just love all that shit. Is that weird? I feel like I feel like that might be weird. Uh, or something cinnamon. I do like me some cinnamon. Uh, I I still have a Yankee candle that I need to burn through this year. It's a apple orchard or something. Eighty five thousand. We are broke as fuck, dude. Holy shit. I like musk and woody scents. Musky scents are nice. Uh, I can only take so much of them. I I, I patchouli is good too. I don't know. I gotta fix my hair, dude. It's, it's not for a haircut, man. Do you guys see this fucking, this dangle, man? I, I, I'm trying a new condition. I'm supposed to give my hair like a natural sheen and I don't like the way it looks. It like fucked up my hair today. So I'm probably gonna wash it out tomorrow and then just go get a haircut and rip that shit off. Why'd you choose to be a park ranger? Uh, I feel like it makes sense for my character. One and two, uh, my character, I think, fits with the theme of where I see the Rangers. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't really have it, uh, like, like a proper answer for you other than, um, I, I just feel like my character just fits with the Ranger. I, I think out of any department that my character fits with, I think the Rangers make the most sense for him. So, I was to pick some candles in Discord. I don't know what I need. Let me see. I'm gonna throw on different music real quick too. Uh, let's take a look. Candles. What we got? Oh, those are cute though. Those are cool. I feel like uh, I, I feel like design candles are kind of gimmicky, but they're they're cool. They look pretty and then you light them on fire and you watch them like burn away. You know what I mean? I don't know. Hmm. That is fucking hot. Not the candle, the coffee I just burnt my mouth on. Not a fan of the sweet scents personally. I have a, I don't know. I don't know. Chad, I got lenses. I got a bunch of lenses. I just bought an adapter for my camera. I'm going to be trying some lens stuff. I got some used lenses, which uh, I, I need to I need to try. I don't know. I don't know which lenses are going to be good, but I'm thinking about the move right now. I actually today was looking at buying a whole new camera. This is a zoom lens. I don't know. This lens is like. Uh... This lens is good for like close up shots, but I don't know. I, I, I haven't really uh, I haven't really decided what, what I'm using it for yet, but I figure at some point soon I want to um, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I just haven't decided. I feel like uh, I feel like I need to get more into cameras, but I learned that my limitation on lenses. I think I know what lens I want to buy. But the question is, do I want to buy a lens or do I want to buy a camera and a lens for a new camera? Because my camera is very limited um, for like what I want to do. But when I move, <laughs> okay, so I'm going to break it down. When I move, I want to turn my entire place into a giant like 
content room. I want to get cameras set up at my kitchen. I want to get shit set up everywhere. Uh, so I'm considering ways of how I'm going to be able to uh, do cooking streams. I, I'm, I'm, I'm looking to kind of like just turn my whole like place into a, a big content room. But I want to... Uh, I, I want to get lenses for certain situations where I can set my camera up differently. And I got this Sigma that might... Oh, might do good before I drop it. <laughs> um, I don't know if it'll... Uh, if it'll... If it'll be good. I, I don't know. It's kind of a... It's kind of a janky lens, though. I don't know if it'll... If it'll really do what I want it to do. Turning your studio in, in apartment to an actual studio. I think it'd be fun. But I don't know. This, uh, candles reminded me of those handcrafted soaps. Handcrafted soaps are cool. Um, I don't know. I'm not a big, like, soap person, though. I don't know. The only soap that I really buy, like, um... I buy, like, a really nice bar soap for, like, when I shower and stuff, but that's about as far as I go. And I love the smell of, of that, uh, that soap. And luckily, it's on Amazon, which is where I buy most of my soap, because I'm gonna be honest with you, gonna buy that shit in person is a nightmare. You ever meet somebody who... You ever, you ever meet somebody who's really big into something, like, scents, or, like, uh, you know, something to that degree? And you go in person. I went. I went to. Uh, I went to Best Buy. To my non-U.S. friends, Best Buy is just an electronic store. Uh, and I walked in to buy a new battery, uh, a, a new UPS, which is an uninterruptible power supply. So if I ever have like lightning strike or surges in power or something to that regard, uh, it. Um, what do you call it? It'll protect my, my, my equipment, essentially. So, um, I went in and I was looking to buy that. Where do you go? You go to the electronics section, like the computer section. So I go to the computer section and I, I talked to the guy and I was waiting for him. And while I was waiting for him, this motherfucker was like, cameras. And I was like, oh yeah, cameras. He goes, nah, you, uh, you interested? And I was like, ah, nah, not today, man. And he's like, you should be interested today. I'm like, what? He goes, let me talk to you. And he's, he like breaks it down. He's like, I'm, I'm a, I'm a photography major. And I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, I think everybody should have a nice camera. And Dude, if, you, if you have a nice camera, that too. Uh, 38 East Babylon to on a black 4GT. Started taking off when I started tailing it for a second. What a problem, man. I thought I'd probably stop. Like, by one time. Copy that. I'm in an explorer, but I can be in route to assist. You're good. You're good. I'll let you know if anything happens. Confirm. Um, but yeah, he, he was like, I think everybody should have a nice camera. And if you don't have a nice camera, I think you should start investing in a nice camera because pictures are going to last a lifetime. And he's going on. Dispatch 490 When I tell you, this motherfucker went on for like 20 minutes. I'm like trying to be nice with him. And I looked at him and I'm like, that's cool, dude. I'm here to pick up an order that I ordered online. He's like, oh yeah, yeah, of course. And he ran over. I mean, he was passionate, but like, it almost seemed like he was trying to pick me up at first. And I'm like, bro, what, what, what going on? <laughs> Why? I need to buy a ring camera. I would love a ring camera. Uh, I just don't think I need it. Ring cameras are like, I think a bare necessity nowadays. I don't know. Maybe that's a me thing. What, what the fuck is going on right now? There, there, had, there was obviously a big situation that occurred, but I don't know, man. I don't know. Jigs, what the fuck going on over there? Malarkey. Helps. Uh, do you know what's going on on channel one at all? God, I, I don't remember, man. Be firm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe yeah, I don't recommend maybe you swap channel you can find out, but I just me, I, I had no idea. Nah, it looks like they got enough units. I'll stay on two unless they request 77s. <laughs> 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 oh, Alright, bud. 
feel like the ring cameras become a uh, felt necessity after something happened that'll spook you. Isn't that how most things kind of come up though? I feel like, see, see, Tim, uh, first off, hello. I hope you're doing amazing and I hope you're doing well. Um, but uh, I, I think that's kind of a big jump to like a big reason for sales in general. Like, 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 look at a, look at a phone, right? When smart, when, when, when the, the iPhone came out, the whole point of it was like, why have your music player? Why have your Garmin? Why have your flip phone when you can just have all three? And it's like, damn, you know what? You are right. I don't want to carry three electronic devices. I want to carry one, right? Everybody needs a doorbell, but oh, what if you had a doorbell that also watched your front door for you? And don't worry, you'll know whenever someone's at your front door, even if you're halfway across the world, you can keep an eye on your house, even when you're not there. And it's like, oh my fucking God, that's amazing. Wait, that's so cool. And you know, then you see the videos online. This, this ring camera caught this, you know, uh, naked guy running across this person's lawn and then getting hit by a car. Turns out that guy was a murderer and the UPS driver caught him while he was dropping off your package. And it's like, bro, you know what? Ring, ring coming in clutch as evidence. I don't know. I might be getting a, a little dramatic with that, but you know what I mean? I, I, I feel, I feel like the drive for the ring cameras was, uh, was that um, the, the, the drive for ring cameras started the same reason why, uh, like people tried monitoring their doors when, um, like porch pirating was like a big thing and it's still a big thing, but it's kind of a deterrent when you think about it. What's up, Arcade? Came to say hi and that I love you all. Have a fun stream. Home late from work and I got to be back early. Don't even worry about it, Arcade. Best of luck at work. I hope it all goes amazing and I hope it all goes pale. You take care. Um, I don't know. I, I right now I'm dealing with a porch pirate situation. My neighbor, I think, is stealing my packages. I I had a a, a factor box that delivered, and I happened to be out, and when I got back, it was gone. I think uh, I think my neighbor stole my food. Factor was amazing and hooked me up, but. It was just one of those, like, you know, I think, uh, I, it was after that. I was like, I, I need a ring camera. I've had packages like leave my porch and I, I've never seen them. Have you tried confronting them about it? No, because they don't speak any English. Zero. Like not even hello, nothing. And I don't feel like I'm, I'm moving in a month. So now at this point, it's like, do I even want to try and make contact with them? I could, but my time to bullshit ratio tells me that the time it would take for me to confront them about stealing my packages wouldn't be worth my time. Because by the time I resolve the issue, I'm not going to be living there anymore. You know what I mean? So if I was still going to be living here, it would be like, yeah, let me try and talk to them and see if I can work it out. But in the next 30 days, am I, is it really going to matter? Probably not, right? It's 10 30 days, go for it tonight. Hey, firm. Uh, dispatch 20. I'm going to be just doing a quick code six up in the hills for any hunters. Should be done in about five, 10 minutes. I wish they actually asked for signatures and wouldn't just leave it at the door. If I could show you all the photo that I have without doxing myself, I would. When before I moved, I lived obviously at home. And where I lived at home, I had a driveway that was relatively long. And I was doing a big stream upgrade. I had raised money for a new computer and a new monitor and a new this and a new that. And everything that I ordered, I checked off signed for delivery. And most things that came were signed for delivery. I bought a really expensive monitor. The monitor I'm currently uh, using. Check. And I was like, okay, how are they going to do this? Stay safe. Have a good night. Um, Because it's kind of a big monitor. I, I hope that they're just careful with it. Hopefully they don't like, you know, fuck around with it. So what, what happens? 
I check my phone. It says delivered. I look outside. I don't see it on the porch. I'm like, what the fuck? So I walk outside to see if they like hit it somewhere. Nope. Didn't sign for delivery. Dropped it off at my mailbox. And the real kicker wasn't the fact that they left the box at the mailbox. The real kicker was that they left the box at the mailbox. And the way that they shipped the monitor in its box was to put a shipping label on the actual box. So anybody walking by and driving by would see just this, the brand of monitor. You could clearly see it's a monitor and it has a shipping label on the side of it. The fact that it didn't get stolen was amazing to me, but I, I remember losing my shit on, uh, I, I, I think it was, uh, I forget who it was. I, I think it was UPS. But I was like, man, you guys like really fucking dropped the ball on this. Like, this is dumb. And their response was, well, did you get your package? Yeah, I got my fucking package, you assholes. Next time I'll just tell you what got stolen because someone left it at the end of the fucking driveway. So, yeah, I got, I got petty with UPS over that. That pissed me off. They still ignore it for delivery and toss the package. They do. Well, and the problem was I checked the shipping and I, I called and they were like, yeah, no, you, you signed for delivery. It shows right here your signature. I'm like, that's not my fucking signature. If I'm, So what I'm guessing happened is they, they signed it over. And when they signed it over, I think they just signed for me instead for the name on the shipping label. I, I, I think the guy actually just like fucked me over. UPS always puts my packages in the dumbest fucking spots and even leaves them in the fucking rain. Oh my God. That shit has happened to me. I've, I've ordered electronics. When I ordered my camera that I'm using now, this camera, right? Uh, it, uh, they, they left the package outside during a, like, a flash flood. We, we had we had gotten warning in New York that this flash flood heavy winds was going to be coming for like three days. The day of delivery, I, I happened to be out and I was busy. So I didn't get to see them like pull into the driveway. And uh, that shit was fucking criminal. Flash flood, the whole things. The package was soaked. Thank God there was a box inside of a box, but I was like, man, you guys, you guys actually fucked me over out here. I love it that Amazon for high price items requires you to, to give the driver a code they don't know. Really? That's actually kind of a cool system. I like that. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think I think the delivery. We have uh, two tens. Just got a trooper truck. Let's go northbound on North Wildford currently. Take a left. Go westbound towards Burger Shot. I don't know. I'm kind of just waking up still. I'm not. 490 up. up. Got it. They went into Bob Smith. Shoot him 50 hard. Keep on him. Keep on him. And then uh, just keep visual. I'm gonna shoot. We're gonna shoot him. Keep visual. Hey, all right. From, he's yeah. He's at uh, Burger Shot right now. Oh, that's plus mode. Did you give him a warning? Oh yeah, he he was. I told him okay. he getting, the car he's getting shot. You already, already shot at him. He's leaving. He hey, just got out of it. He jumped down to the. Okay, you're clear. You're clear to beat him down. You're clear to beat him down. Then if he's out of the car, you don't need to shoot him anymore. I'm on the way. BCB. He's gonna be headed towards Vespucci. God damn it. Copy. I'm down on Vespucci now. A little far east. I don't see anything crossing south yet. I could be hiding. He's got a pickup car here, little hatchback, pussycat on the back of it, it looks like. They have a pickup car for a stolen charger. What the fuck? I remember a few years ago ordering some Christmas gifts and chose to sign for the delivery because of the items. I got a notice they were delivered, but I, uh, uh, it turns out the driver just dropped off a neighbor's. Yeah, they the tried street. to grab him. I'm on this. I had a, oh my God, dude, I had Ricky. I, I had a, <laughs> you guys, do you guys remember the story? Is this happened a couple months ago? All right. Got eyes. He's going to get into the vehicle. My, at the, my the post office driver canals. stole my package. I've got him tased. 
And what they did was the the little like bubble wrap packaging that Amazon has for the the like bubble bags that they 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 ship in. They sent me the bubble wrap package, but you could clearly see that they cut a hole. They they cut across this thing to take the contents out of that bag get back up to and Berkshire still delivered so me an empty it bag. Again. It was it was insane. Yeah, let's just get as long as you get the charger bag, it's fine. I confronted my 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 my, my post office guy. I'm like, how was my soap, you fuck? I didn't say that directly, but I was like, so did you guys like find my soap? And he just kind of looked at me and I'm like, I don't really care. But if you're going to not deliver the, if you're going to deliver it, at least throw out the fucking bag. Don't give me the empty bag. So I have proof. Yeah. The soap incident. It was like five pounds of soap. You weigh that shit. How did that make it through? Which means if the weigh process was confirmed, then it had to have been stolen after the last weigh in. Which was at the destination. No, my friend, you hit my. <laughs> what the fuck are you guys doing? Do you need medical? No, 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 he's okay. We were jaywalking. I'm sorry. No, my primo. He's okay. Adario. You can go. He's okay. Do it, of you bastard. I didn't do a damn thing. I got. We just... were crossing hey. the road and you hit him. Okay? Can you just give us a ride to like the nearest plaza or something, I please? Like a. I can't. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. I, I appreciate I, you. I, I, I can't. I thank can't. you so much. Sir, oh, the, sir, the, the, the sir I'm, go, I, I, I'm going to a call right now. Sir, do you need medical? Would you like me to get you some medical? Yes, yes, yes. He does. He does. He does. Okay. Yes. All right. All right. No, 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 I'm okay. I'm okay. Are you sure? Okay. Never mind. Never mind. You he promise. Okay. Okay. Fine, fine, you fine, absolutely fine. guarantee. Definitely I don't want promise. To, I don't want you calling ambulance and shit like that. Okay. All right. All right. No problem. All right. Thank you. Well. PDD EMS. No, 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 no
have an actual question. How long does it take for you guys to take a shit? Everybody. This is this is a very important question, and I have a reason to ask. Poop cord? Ooh. The poop cord. Like less than five minutes? Okay. Depends on how long the label on the bottle is. God damn it. Two to five minutes. Uh, if I'm not on TikTok. One to two minutes. Okay. This is this is sort of what I'm 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 getting at. Ten minutes to an hour. I mean that's that's fair. That's 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 fair. Five or less, great. I don't think your shits should take more than five minutes normally. Right? These people who have imprints on your legs because you're too busy scrolling your fucking memes and your goddamn TikTok and posting mean things on Reddit about streamers doing absolutely nothing in roleplay. Listen, I, I'm going I'm to just, just rip the bandaid off. Enough with your 30-minute shits. Some of us have things to do. Medical issues. If you have medical issues, that, that's one thing, right? But if, if you just are, if you're just normal Joe Schmo out here looking to, you know, out here looking to, what do you call it? I don't know. I'm just saying, I, I just, I, I don't think it should take that fucking long. charges real quick hold up flop i'm into cells hey sorry tommy real quick really important uh i Is bent it? over sprawled eagle and took the fattest shit of my life today <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk soon Excuse me. Hello. Hi. Hey. Hey. Hello. How we doing? Doing pretty good. How are you? I'm great. Hey. Hey. Could we do a a little bit? Just a little bit of favor. Just a little bit. You want me to slow down? Yeah. Just, just, just a little bit. Favor. Just, of course. just yeah. a little bit. Yeah. yeah we can do that. Hundred percent. Oh, All that right. favor. Okay. Yeah. We can do right. that yeah. favor. That's no problem. I mean, I have another favor that might cost ten bucks. Oh. Uh, why I pick you up? No. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. He has to at least make it twenty. Me. Hey, can, we consider. can we meet in the middle at like 15? Yeah, absolutely. I'll be there I need a little you... early though, probably. Okay. Could you all uh, just tweet out wishing Richard Tips a happy birthday? R R Richard who? Richard Tips. Or, or his nickname is Dick Tips. So I mean, which... it is short for Richard, so that, yeah, that, makes, yeah. that makes perfect sense. Exactly. If you could just, you know, just be like, hey, Dick Tips, I heard it was your birthday. Happy birthday. I hope I hope your 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 45th birthday goes well. Okay. Here, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll leave it in here. Listen, we'll, we'll 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 properly incentivize this, okay? I have my twat ready. I said wishing Dick Tips a happy birthday. Wow, 45. Crazy. Perfect. Yeah, should I twat that? There you go. There's, Split there's it amongst. All righty. There's my twat. You see it? Awesome. Thank you. Thank you save, so much. Yep. You guys yep. are incredible. By the way, it's not actually his birthday, but when he calls it out, just gaslight the shit out of him. All right? Oh, okay. that's great. Absolutely. I love gaslighting. I'm the king of gaslighting. Perfect. Anyway. I love to hear that shit. Awesome. That Slow it down. All right?
What's up, Richard? Hi, Flop. What's hey, going on, what's buddy? Up, hey, buddy. Hey, hey, little guy. Hey, little guy. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm just calling to wish you a happy birthday. I didn't realize it was your birthday today. It's not my birthday. It's my in-city car. Like, um, joy, uh, I, uh, birthday tomorrow. Is it? Yeah, two years. Oh, a, a bunch of people were just twatting out. Uh, what? Eugene Bartholomew, happy birthday, Dick Tips. Wishing Dick Tips a happy birthday. Wow, 45, crazy. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what are you with these people? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not 45. And it's not. <laughs> what is happening? I don't know, buddy, but happy birthday. Uh, we'll uh, we'll talk soon, all right? Wait, what do you mean talk soon? When are we, uh, are we doing that thing? Or, uh, you're not feeling it. I mean, I'm always feeling like taking a shit, but, you know, I, I don't know if today's the day. You don't want to? Okay, that's fine. What uh? What, I mean, what, what time? What time are you guys thinking? We, we'll give it. We'll give a little bit. We'll give a little bit. Like you, like half an hour, maybe an hour. You think? Yeah, yeah, sure. That that works for me. Yeah, that works for you. Okay, yeah, yeah, that right, works for you. That works for me. All right. As long as it works for my time, right, it works for time, we're good. Yeah, well, I'll, 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 I'll let people know. All right, awesome. Sounds good. Talk to you. Mwah. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor. His nickname is Nips. Dick Nips is his full name. Oh, Dick Nips. Dispatch 220 10 8. Happy birthday, Richard Tips. Tips, it's your birthday. Still be on one. I need, I need, I need everybody's help. Yeah. 20? You guys, you guys know what Chef Tony's is, right? The seasoning, Chef Tony's seasoning. What? Please tell me somebody knows about Chef Tony's seasoning. No clue. Creole seasoning? Yeah, Chef Tony's Creole seasoning. Yeah. Okay, do you remember it being called Chef Tony's? Yeah. Apparently that's not a fucking thing anymore, guys. Apparently it it's called? never been called Chef Tony's. It's Chef Chi Chi Raz or some shit. Isn't it like Tony and then like a his Yeah, last Tony Chi Chi Raz or something like that. But I remember the bottle specifically saying Chef Tony's. Yeah, I do too. What the fuck is Chef Tony's? That's not a thing. That's not a thing. We've been Mandala affected, guys. It's uh, we we universes have collided again. Oh, Tony Sacheries, yeah. Yeah, that used the bottle used to be called Chef Tony, right? No, Tony Sacheries. What? It was Chef Tony, dude. No, I thought I remembered it being Tony Sacheries. What did you find out about Skechers? About sketchers. What? About sketchers. How do you spell it? S K E C H. See, I always remembered as S K E T C H. Yeah, there's a T in there. I thought there was. There ain't a T. There's no T. Sketchers. There's no T. Sketchers. I found out the hard way, Dan. Sketchers. <laughs> I think it just broke Dan. What's up, Duck? Uh, what is a hatch? You mean like a like a? What do you mean? That's pretty cool. What is what is Tony? Sh 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 the flop. It's not my birthday. <laughs> What is this? It's my birthday. It's not my birthday. What is what is this seasoning? <laughs> oh man, I'm I'm a dick. God. Uh, it's Creole seasoning. What is Creole seasoning? Seasoning. Fuck! I can't talk. Um. I don't even know what it is. You don't know Creole seasoning? No, I don't think so. 
like for like gumbo or krayo rice okay well that would that would explain i didn't eat gumbo growing up and i also didn't eat a lot of rice growing up the rice that i got growing up was like you know the 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 rice i ate growing up was like the the instant rice or the 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 cheap shit easy rice because it's all we i don't know that, that was kind of like what i had in in the house it's using louisiana style it's just pretty much radio check yeah i don't know and dude that 10-2 I got 30 southbound off Rafa Drive. Just uh, Karuma was leaving a switch activity call. It's occupied a couple times. They're on the radio. They're on the radio. I need 77. What's the plate on it? Uh, roll 20. Copy that. I just stopped them for doing 72 before. I'm in route. Uh, what is your update at 20? Two twenty is in route. 77 request North Rafa Drive. <clears throat> Oh, five, six, 76. God damn it. All right. Anyway, um, I just got home from seeing uh, fam in Vegas. How you all doing? Ooh, well, I hope the fam in Vegas is good. I'm doing great. How are you doing today? Suarez, what's your status? Dispatch 220. Uh, show me attached 38 southbound North Rock for drive. Suarez is Ocean King. You weren't doing anything suspicious. You weren't doing anything illegal. See what's going on here. I got, uh, yeah, do you, well, do you guys, uh, uh, uh there's a lot of play though. Well, I'm gonna ask one more time, okay? Do you guys have anything illegal for the driver specifically? Well, Does anywhere okay. will cry or 77s right now? You know what? We got three attached with 38. I think we should be Ocean King. Thanks, though, Jimbo. Hey, firm. Actually, do, you think, do you think you should be allowed to leave? You think so? Are you sure about that? You, you, you sure you want to leave? Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Book so is there a reason why I, uh, is there a reason why I should keep you guys here? Oh, hi. Didn't I just no, stop absolutely. you guys? No, that's There's crazy. There's no reason why you should keep us here. No, Not sir. No. Didn't I just, a bit. didn't I, didn't, I think I just yeah, stopped we, you guys. Yeah, we, we just, we just twatted on the twatters. Uh, yeah, we twatted on Twitter. Oh, good shit. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, All right. No hey, All right. You're free to go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nope. Nope. Ah, uh, you free to go? All right. Have a good day. All right. Thirty. Let's go for it. Thank you, Flop. Yep. Not a problem. Dispatch your twenty. Back in service. <clears throat> no. -uh. What's up, baby? How are you doing? Bald! 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 Hey! Hey, what's up? Hey! Hey, Flop, I got a problem with one of your rangers. Yeah, what you got? What did Maple do? No, this one oh, is tips. tips. Yeah, what's no. up? What do you got? He, dis he disobeyed my command and says he doesn't need to follow it. Uh... Oh boy. That's right. What do you recommend it for strike points? Oh, not strike points. I say he runs a lap. Are you. What rank are you, Kurt? You're Corporal. I'm a Corporal. Yeah. Tell his dumb ass to run a damn lap. You got that power. Mm, mm, that's right. That's right. I'll you tell got... him. Oops, I just said that right. Nice. 1022 my last that's right that's uh, right all right i'm gonna give him a call listen you do you do what you gotta do if richard's stepping out of line listen kurt i got the full faith that you're responsible enough to make that choice for yourself i don't think you need a sergeant mm. for that i think you got this 
All right. Thank you, Flop. Thank not you. a problem. Give him a call. Yeah, not a problem. Give I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Could be better dealing uh, with an upset stomach and a period. Uh, that sounds like a fucking awful time. I'm sorry you feel that way. Uh, hopefully you start feeling better. Oh my god. Yeah. Do you guys know anything about photography? Ooh. Oh my god. I need photography help. Depends what's up. I'm either looking to, so I, I have a choice here. Uh, I am either looking at, I, I need a new lens for streaming. I, sh I showed you guys yesterday why I want a new lens for streaming. But the reason I'm looking for a new lens is because I want something with a low aperture so that it's good in low light, but also close enough and gives that like really nice natural bokeh. Uh, I, I want something that, that's soft and shallow uh, or, or something, something uh, soft and with like a lot of depth in the background. So obviously I'm looking at something with a low aperture. I'm either looking at an F2.8 uh, multi zoom or multi zoom variable zoom excuse excuse me um from sigma it's about a thousand dollars for this lens but this lens would encompass everything the problem is that i would have to buy a new camera body to get this lens to work that's fine now the reason i'm asking though is because the question now becomes do i do that uh kurt you on radio or do I find a lens that is comparable, uh, the building. but a contemporary uh, building? A building. Yeah, sorry. Tips just said fucking. Report the IA building, please. He just he's saying fucking I. He said building, and I. Do, do I get a contemporary lens though? Around what I'm looking for, I'm looking at like a 30 millimeter 1.4 at uh, a, a, a 30 a 30 mil 1.4 contemporary, or like a 34 millimeter. I, w I want a closer view for my face, but the other the other offset is this other you know zoom lens i think for streaming for like video and changing my zoom to different angles i think would make the most sense as it would encompass a lot more and i can still get f2.8 to look good you know what i mean so i'm trying to figure out do i buy a new body and a new le uh, lens or do i just buy uh the contemporary lens and deal with the one zoom that i have uh, what camera do you have and what lens do you have? So I don't have a lens yet. I, I, I did just buy an adapter though. I acquired this one. Uh, so I'm probably going to give it a try. This is a Sigma. Uh, what is this one? This one isn't that good. This is a Sigma 18 to 200. Uh, with a 3.5. So, I mean, it's not like a really crazy lens, but it is a, a proper zoom lens. Uh, so I, I bought an adapter to get that to work with my camera for now to try stuff. Um, but, uh, I don't know if this is going to do what I want it to do. So I'm looking to get a, um, the, the lens I want to get is a Sigma, uh, 24 to 70, 47s and 32s and vehicles leaving the scene. I, I, I want to get, uh, it was mine running through a scene with clowns and then uh moped exploded and there were gunshots i want to get this thing i'd like to get a new one if i could find one hello copy give me a second here we go all right so i i want to i think i want to get one of these um oh my god what is my fucking brave doing dude because i think this would encompass most of what i need to do but the question is if i do this do i want to get you know right but to, to answer your question I, I have a canon m200 uh it's got an efm mount not an ef an efm uh which is doesn't have a lot of options for my camera but i went with this camera because it is a perfect uh it's got it's got pass through to be used as a webcam and it was the most budget mirrorless camera i could find i didn't think i was gonna need anything more for a 
stream camera because I don't use my camera all the time. If I wanted to get like a nice, nice, nice camera, I would have, but now I'm like in a weird spot where do I just get maybe like a Sony? It is what's pictured. What does that even mean? Is that a good thing? Check out BH photo. I, I I know about BH photo. Um, but I don't know. And then the other question is what camera do I want? I'm actually looking at a Sony FX3 right now, used, obviously. Cause uh they're nice cameras, but they are expensive. So I don't think I want to get an FX3. I am looking at like an A72 or an A73 though. Yo, what's up, Dexon? How you doing? Roll 20s. Dispatch I love you flop. I love you guys. What do you mean? What do uh, you mean? Those are my homies right there. Stay here. Make sure everything is under control. Yeah, I, I have a Canon M200. It's a not so fancy camera. It was just something that was better than a webcam. And it gave me the option to play around, 